following is a non-profit fan parody. Goki as and Goku is R2 is the property of, well, all these people. Please support the official release. Your Majesty, it seems that only two people outside of the project have seen C2. How shall we proceed? Destroy the ghetto! Leave no one alive! Sire, don't you think that's a little excessive? I seem to recall your grandmother was an Eleven, Bartley. I'll be quiet. as well as a stormtrooper. Come out and face me, NOW! You think you're in a position to make demands? I could ask you the very same question. Wouldn't make much sense, but I could. I'm the one in the nightmare. But I'm Prince Clovis. Prove it. I hate Elevens. Well, I'll give you this. Hey, you're not Prince Clovis. Very perceptive. Now give me your nightmare. No. Did you hear me? I said, give me your nightmare. I said, no. Give me your friggin' nightmare. No, god damn it. Crap, I'm forgetting to do something. Use your kios. Shut up, C2. God, I fears that for myself. Friggin' you know it all. Alright, let's see here. I have to one divided by C2. Ah, screw this. God, fine. I'll try the gear. Oh, you're happy, you friggin' controlling twat. Give me your nightmare. <laughs> the password is Ukariba Phone. Wakey wakey, sleepyhead! Oh god, it's Mardi Gras all over again. Oh, hi Lloyd. I'm not gonna ask. Apparently that pocket watch you're holding saved your life. Wait a minute. What? Apparently it deflected our bullets. So wait, my pocket watch protected me more than the military-approved bulletproof vest. Alright, Kudurugi, you can either go through a season of painful rehabilitation, in which you would finish in just barely in time for R2, where you would be as a minor henchman, or what's behind door number two. I can't risk my main character status. Door number two. Congratulations. A car? No, a dangerous seventh generation prototype... Nightmare frame without an ejector seat. But not a car. No. How the hell am I supposed to get a love interest on this show without a car? Chick stick John Robots. Good evening and welcome to the six o'clock news. I'm your anchor, Oswald the Denswald. <laughs> Our top story today. Convicted hitman Jimmy Two Shoes McClarty confessed today that he was once hired to beat a cow to death in a rice field using only two small porcelain figures. <laughs> Police admit this may be the first known case of a knick-knack paddywhack. Ding, 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 phone call, phone call, click. Hey, Shirley, is there a TV near you by any chance? Lulu, this is swim practice. What makes you think we have a TV near us? Well, do you have a TV near you? Ah, oh, crap, where are the missiles on this thing? I mean, um, what's on the news? Let's see here. Gundam fights, no, 
Let's continue. Traffic restrictions. The usual stuff. Why? Oh crap! Was that a tank? I mean, um, uh, nope, no reason. Bye now. Crap! Definitely a tank. God damn it! That sorry excuse for eleven just hung up on me. Damn, pretend! How dare you slaughter these innocent people that we are gonna use poison gas on? And uh, this is kind of awkward. Take the train tracks west if you want to win. Why should I? Fine. Please take the train tracks west if you want to win. Freaking bitch. That's much better. <laughs> Won't let you get away from. Show to the train. Roger. Boeing. Boeing. I see. That's your plan, eh? It's lucky for me, I brought an extra soldier just in case. You go after him. Why, sure thing, boss. Oh God damn it! Hey, what the hell are you doing? Someone got distracted. Retreat. Ejection sheet activated. <laughs> Thanks for the help, but where the heck did you get that Sutherland? And uh, hey, is he gone? Oh, ninja. Or, go Ogi, did the boys tell you to come here too? Or, no, crack is Sheila, we all we saw was you breaking formation. What are you thinking? Are you the one in charge? Who wants to know? The guy that's giving you a trailload of Sutherlands in exchange for commanding your forces. Gasp! Rocky Met, that sounds fair, but we ain't making a habit out of this. <laughs> that's what you think. Your Majesty, it seems that our, the terrorists have wiped out all our forces. Damn it! Now what are we supposed to do? Deus ex machina. Boy, what the hell do you want? Well, uh, well I was gonna let you use the lancelot. But wait, I can use the lancelot? Well, not since you're being such an ass about it. Ooh, I'm Prince Clovis. I think I do whatever I want. I'm sorry. Now that's more like. What? Launching. <laughs> Zero to holy crap in less than a second! I can't believe we're going to win this conflict. This battle even. Hey, what the heck is that? Very slow charge! Heavens to Megatroid! Oh, boss. Oh. There's this one fighter kicking all our asses. What the? What's wrong with you? Anyone left? Only Collins, sir. What the? Hell, Colin's the only one left and she has the worst nightmare out of all of you. What is wrong with you? Oh, there's no need for shouting. Come on, use an indoor voice. I don't have an indoor voice! Uh, hello? Oh crap, lost another one. This is for Lelouch! Who would have thought irony would hurt so much? Ow, this hurts like hell. I'll get you, you damn terrorist! Over Rivel's dead body, you will! Hey, I'm here to rescue you! Hell no. Damn it, I gotta get out of here. Retreat! Oh, I'm right behind you on that one. We've conveniently found him. Now to wipe them all out. Attention, everyone. I, Prince Clovis, order you to cease fire and let the Elevens go. This command is in no way suspicious. Have a nice day. Okay, I did what you asked me. Now, who are you? I'm your brother. No, you're not. The dead one. Oh, wait, you're alive? Yeah, I am now your Jesus. Dun dun dun! Nice! If you don't like your job, you don't strike! You just go in every day and do it really half-assed! That's the American way! Oh, oh.